stupidity bill. Yeah. 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 We, we all traveled down that road before, okay? But your flesh cannot please God. Look at your neck and say, my flesh can't please God. God don't work like that. Don't be deceived. God is not mocked. He don't play that. The flesh, that's the unrenewed nature that's in us. So, so what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Well, the step that you take is so important. To do a daily examination of All yourself. Right. Yes. Yes. Say, I got to examine myself. Yes. I, come on, tell, yes. talk to yourself. Yes. I got to examine myself. Yes. Now, now, now. I didn't say pound on yourself because the enemy brings condemnation on that. Yes. But the word of God said, examine yourself to see that if you are in the faith, uh -huh. and that is Jesus Christ is in you. Yes. Amen. 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 Second Corinthians 13, 5, that's what that was. So examine yourself to see if you're exemplifying a godly Christian character. Yes. And I just didn't say Christian. I said godly God, I, Christian yes. character. Because if we say we Christians, you know, that, that don't mean a lot of us. Right. Not in the day. If you say you're a Christian, they say, really? Okay, yeah. Uh -huh. they, don't, they don't wait a lot. But when you're walking in the light, yeah. the light brings visibility to things that will otherwise be darkened or invisible. Yeah. Before the earth was created, Genesis 1 tells us that the earth was without void. Yeah. And void in form. And empty and darkness was upon the face of the deep. And God had to call forth light. Mm -hmm. And there was light. Yeah. See, sometimes we get ourselves in some dark situations right. as children of God. Right. Right. God had to call us out of darkness. Come on, come on. Some of us have been called out of depression. Yes. Yes. Some of us have been called out of poverty. Yes. Some of us have been called out of gossiping. Yes. Some of us have been called out of lesbianism. Yes. Some of us have been called out of cheating. Yes. Some of us have been called out of doubting. He called us out of darkness into his marvelous light. How many people have been called out of something? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You see, darkness cannot overcome light. But must give way to the power of the light. Because light reveals any disorder that may be present within us. We actually have to deal with the iniquity that's within us. Search me, O oh Lord. Remove anything that's not like you. We, oh my God. How do we walk in the light as a believer. How do we walk in the light? What to walk in the light as a believer? First of all, you need to know who the light is. We do know, but do we have a relationship with him? We do know him, but do we deny the power thereof? Without God and his truth and his word and without a relationship, we are in darkness. God's light is a means of direction. Say direction. direction. And in him is no darkness at all. That's 1 John 1 and 5. Now the light begins to bring order and balance to that which was hidden by the darkness. The word of God says that the steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord, which means God will show you your destination and how to overcome the obstacles during the process of achieving the vision. Yes. Dependent, dedication, and destination. Yes. God has a way of bringing light to his people no matter what the circumstances are. First Corinthians 2, 9 said, I have not seen, nor ear have heard, nor has it entered into the heart of men the things, watch this, that's already been prepared for them that love him. God has revealed them unto us by his spirit. For the spirit is such of all things, even the deep things 
of God. Now that's the effects of the light. Amen.